Hello everyone, welcome to my General Hospital official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Charlotte Cassidyne, a teen, is staying true to her younger self. Valentine and Nana make a shocking revelation about Charlotte in the General Hospital recap for September 19, 2023. Highlights from General Hospital Valentine and Nina caught Charlotte breaking into Anna and Valentine's room just as Charlotte paid a visit to Anna in this episode. Sonny spoke with a Pikeman representative and issued a warning to Dex. Marshall had a conversation with Selena, while Trina told Curtis about Spencer. Finally, Cody had an important idea for Sasha. Let's delve a little deeper into the details now. Charlotte hasn't changed, and Valentine and Nino were shocked to watch Charlotte ransacking Anna and Valentine's room on Metro Court's surveillance camera. When Anna called to tell him Charlotte had arrived in their room, he asked Nina not to tell anybody else who they had seen in the video. When the cops arrived to take Anna's report on the break-in, Valentine appeared to lose his cool but immediately recovered. The cops suspected this was related to the fire at Anna's house, but Anna had no idea. When Anna questioned Valentine if he had seen the surveillance film, he lied and said it was missing from their floor. Nina later re-watched the film, and we finally saw Charlotte enter the room as Nina said, Charlotte, what have you done? Sonny informed Dex at his money laundering eatery that the feds would be watching his every move from now on. Dex was even permitted to enter the room when a pikeman official arrived to offer Sonny money to continue working with him despite his incarceration. They wanted to negotiate another deal, but Sonny refused until the individual who had tipped off the feds was found. Sonny was later impressed when Dex assessed pikeman and determined that they were not the ones who handed him in. Sonny finally admitted to planting the evidence that led to his incarceration. Marshall was concerned that the Savoy's business was slowing. When Selena arrived with her goons, things went from bad to worse. She stated she was merely there for a brief drink to show her support for Curtis. She made a point of mentioning how the club no longer had the same appeal, but Marshall was insistent that he wasn't selling. Portia was overjoyed when Trina showed up to play video games with her and Curtis, but she felt left out because she was not a gamer. When Portia received a crucial text, she disappeared, leaving Curtis and Trina alone to discuss. She tried to persuade Curtis to spend more time at the Savoy, but he stated he wasn't sure he could keep the club open. Yes, he liked the sight, but now that he was in a wheelchair, he felt differently about it. When Curtis switched the topic to Trina, she told him about her upcoming vacation to New York with Spencer. She also revealed that she hadn't notified Portia about the short trip. She understood exactly how her mother felt about Spencer, but she also had to admit to Curtis that she thought she was in love with him. Trina simply wasn't ready to say, I love you first. Curtis told his newfound daughter to enjoy the present moment. Portia went to the Savoy to talk to Necker and discovered that Selena and Marshall had an argument earlier in the evening. Nettie and Olivia also showed up at Curtis' nightclub, where Nettie quickly got a job if he could finish the song he was writing. Sasha was taken aback when Sam and Cody discovered a vial of pills in Dr. Montague's jacket that could have killed her. Sasha, Sam, Cody, and Dante went over everything that had happened to Sasha since she petitioned the court to withdraw her guardianship and discovered that Monte was attempting to take as much of Sasha's money as possible for his poker habit. Sasha believed that turning themselves in to the authorities and telling them the truth was the best way to address their current predicament, but Cody, Sam, and Dante believed that they required proof of what Dr. Montag and Gladys were up to. Sam and Dante were determined to unearth something and utilize Max's generosity to bail Cody out of a legal bind. Cody recommended that he and Sasha simply vanish when they departed. Will Brooke Lynn Quartermain succeed in courting Granny Tracy? Spoilers for General Hospital for September 20, 2023 include family discord, emotional stress, medical questions, and much more. You won't want to miss a single second of this dramatic new episode. Highlights from General Hospital 
Brooke Lynn is sick of lies and dishonesty, particularly at dishonesty. While she did not lose Chase as a result of her business espionage antics, she did lose Maxie as a BFF and feels terrible about what she's done to her buddies. To that aim, she lashes out against Brenny Tracy, Jane Elliott, the lady who convinced her that she had no choice but to steal Deception's secrets. She had no idea Tracy would try to sue Deception and nearly bankrupt it. When Tracy attempts to make peace, BLQ chastises her. Meanwhile, Lucy and Maxie are still resolved to salvage Deception, but they disagree on how they should go about it. Will Maxie go insane after learning Lucy turned down Tracy's newest settlement offer? Nina is preoccupied with a number of issues. Nina could use a vacation after discovering her own truth about the SEC call, Sonny's mob difficulties, Sasha's kidnapping, and seeing who was on that surveillance tape. According to GH spoilers, she treads carefully. Does she run across Anna and have to cover Valentin's secret, or does she have to hide her own deeds? Elizabeth seriously questions Gregory's choice of doctor, and she even has Finn reconsidering his decision to be his father's son rather than his doctor. Now, Finn must reconsider his decision and weigh in on Gregory's care. Will Gregory take his advice and look for a doctor who can treat his sickness on a more personal level? Finn is now on a steep slope that blurs the borders between family and professionalism, thanks to Elizabeth's assistance. According to General Hospital teasers, Selena Wu has made it known to Marshall Ashford that she wants to buy the Savoy, and he has made it clear that the bar is not for sale. Having said that, Port Charles Queen Mont B dislikes hearing the word no. Marshall has received a few threats from her, but he has dismissed them. The main reason Ashford refuses to sell the tavern is his son Curtis Ashford. After all, he's gone through a lot, being shot, fighting for his life, and now being diagnosed with a likely life sentence in a wheelchair. With everything happening on in Curtis' life, especially his health, not to mention his rocky relationship with his new bride Portia Robinson, Marshall believes the Savoy provides him with a distraction as well as something to hold on to. Curtis' bar was a venture he left private investigation for, and he had built it up to be the it destination in the small town it is today. Marshall has no intention of selling it to Wu. It could give Curtis the impression that he has nothing in his life. Wu is still an influential figure in Port Charles. Fans have yet to discover what she is really capable of, and while she alternates between good and dangerous mob leader, her true nature may be revealed very soon. Marshall has been warned, but he hasn't taken her threats seriously. That's because Miss Wu has only given lip service. Could Selena decide to act violently to send a strong message to Marshall? An explosion at home. Perhaps one of her thugs runs him over, sending him in the hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. Perhaps there will be several activities in the same week to really drive home her message. In any case, Selena Wu will make it quite known that she means business and will not relent until the Savoy is hers. But will anything out of the ordinary cause Marshall to cave? Will this lead to a conflict for which Mr. Ashford is unprepared? So what do you guys think about this update? Let me know in the comments below. And if you like my videos, please press like and subscribe for more. I'll see you guys next time.